Moving on now to another family story. Jean-Michel Cousteau has spent a lifetime exploring the oceans following in the footsteps of his father, famous filmmaker Jacques Cousteau. Equipped with an IMAX camera, Jean-Michel and his crew filmed 100 hours of underwater footage that reveals how the smallest life in the sea is vital to all life on the planet. And the result is a 40-minute documentary in spectacular 3D. VOA's Penelope Pulu spoke with Cousteau and tells me all about him, the movie, and its mission. He started diving since he was seven years old. Wow. And now he's, he's in his 70s. He's been diving for 69 years. Wow. And he keeps on diving. And his father was a famous ocean explorer, right? Right, Jacques Cousteau. He was actually the pioneer of underwater exploration. Mm. We all grew up with him. So you had the chance to sit down with Jean-Michel and sort of pick his brain about this new film. Talk to us about that. Uh, the film is very intriguing and impressive on many levels. Number one, it was filmed with these breakthrough cutting edge cameras using new technology that allowed him to record microscopic underwater creatures in slow motion 3D, he was able to film 30 new species, many of which could not be seen with the naked eye. When you're filming it, you bring it back up to the boat where we are, and we have a 3D screen and we can see it with glasses on, you can see something we have never seen before. It's almost uh, unreal. Yeah. that this is made by nature and yet it is under there and very few of us know how it looks. And that's exactly the purpose of his film. Not only to entertain, but to show us that this world exists and we are unwittingly destroying it. Mm. I wanted to talk about that because he has a very specific mission in terms of how he relates what he films under the sea. He advocates two things. One is the water needs to stay clean for the underwater species that are feeding us at the end of the day. But it also needs to remain clean because we are going to need this water for drinking purposes and irrigation purposes. He says at this point, fresh water on our planet is less than 1% of the total sum of water that we have. Cousteau is a fervent proponent of desalination to create clean water for drinking and irrigation. But he says that can only happen on a large scale if we clean the runoff before it flows into the ocean. Today you have between four and 5,000 children under the age of five that are dying every day, every day, every day because they have no access to clean water or enough water. That can change. We can decide to make it happen. What struck you most when you had the chance to sit down with Cousteau and talk to him? What struck you most about your conversation? How vivacious he is. Mm. I felt such envy <laughs> to look at this man. First of all, the life he leads. To leave, he leads a life underwater. You can see that he's totally a fish out of the water when he's <laughs> in a suit and a tie. Right. He loves, reveres his father and his legacy. That's why he created the Ocean Futures Society, which is to educate people and to talk about the legacy of underwater exploration. But, you know, he will also, you know, be a little bit of uh, flirtatious. He actually connected at some point to tell me, you know, I'm gonna tell you a secret. I once drank a 2,000 year old wine. <laughs> and I said, how is that possible? He said, well, we were diving somewhere in Greece. I'm not going to tell you the location. We found this ancient shipwreck wow. and we found wine in some of the ancient containers. So we decided to, to taste it. I said, how did it taste? He said, terrible. But I can say I drank a 2,000 year old wine. <laughs> That's incredible. So you got a chance to have a little bit of a personal connection Definitely, with him. Yeah. That's, that's amazing. In covering this, this film, what is it that you hope people, viewers, take away from it? The reality that we're all connected. Animals, human beings, uh, little microorganisms, plankton, zooplankton, phytoplankton, whatever. We're all connected. We destroy one part of it, we destroy everything. I always believe that film is the connecting form, form of every culture, of all cultures. And this is exactly what this film is doing. It's putting you right there, somewhere where you would never be otherwise, 
to show you this is what is being destroyed. Mm. Preserve it. It is our heritage to preserve. It's our privilege, as he put it, to preserve life on Earth. Now, to see Penelope's entire story on Cousteau's film Secret Ocean 3D, head to our website, voanews.com.